Meet GDB client, Eva Maria Contreras. Hi, so my name is Eva Maria, um, and this is my guide dog. His name is Chauncey. Eva Maria and Chauncey sit on a blanket on the lawn at GDB's California campus. I've always wanted a guide dog since I was little. Uh, I remember in kindergarten, I would go and see people with guide dogs, and I always wanted one. So it's been really, really exciting and just really surreal. Like, it's so freeing and like I can walk so fast and he's just a really really good boy <laughs> every day he impresses me with the things he does and how smart he is and how learn how quickly he learns so I live in Arizona uh, I just graduated high school so in the fall I'll be starting at the University of Arizona Honors College the team walks on city sidewalks with their guide dog instructor and I'm gonna major in biology and hopefully become a physical therapist and I'll have Chauncey with me the whole time, so that's really cool. When I turned 16, I started researching uh, different schools and guide dogs came up. I also knew people around town who had guide dogs from GDB. So in like talking to guide dogs and like researching, I just really fell in love with the school, just how like they really want to customize it and make it for me. It's not like a one size fits all. I feel like the matching process also is I've heard from different people that it's really awesome and I can attest to that because Chauncey's perfect for me. And um, yeah, I just really fell in love with like all the support they had even after graduation, which is really cool. But Chauncey gets really excited and he loves to play. And that's really awesome because I, I really love dogs and I love that they like to play and I like to play with him too. But also he's very calm and a very like, he can settle really well and that's perfect for like classes. He's not going to be too like hyper when I'm sitting in a long biology lecture. He could just like settle next to me. Chauncey seated at Eva Maria's side at an outdoor cafe table. And he's also really cautious traveling. So he just really wants to be right when he does things. The team walks on the grounds of the GDB campus. He's also a very good memorizer. Like he can memorize everything really, really well and that's gonna be awesome for college and memorizing like where my classes are and uh, targeting things. He loves to target. So yeah, he's really, really awesome. For my life in Arizona, it's gonna be very, very hot. Um, so we've been doing a lot of routes with his, all his booties because he's gonna have to learn how to do that. But also we visited a college campus um, and kind of practice how I would teach him routes to different places on campus. And I think that's very valuable for when I transition to college and just teaching him where my classes are and teaching him how to like find different things on campus. And I really think that what I've learned here, I'll be able to apply very well um, at home. His puppy raisers told us that he likes to be called puppy and I done that a little bit and he really does respond to that which is really cute. Puppy! <laughs> He's so cute. To all the puppy raisers and just all the volunteers that help out uh, with guide dogs for the blind, uh, I would just uh, say thank you. Thank you for all your work. Thank you for your dedication and all those hours that you put in just to help. I mean this is life-changing for me. I also wanted to say thank you to all the donors. Thanks for your generous donations. All of these things are free. I never have to worry about Chauncey's veterinary care or anything like that. And I get to have him healthy and happy. I'm just really grateful that there's just people out there that want to help and, and just change someone's life. Photo of Eva Maria and Chauncey. For more information about Guide Dogs for the Blind, please visit our website at guidedogs.com or call us at 800-295-4050.